Good morning guys. Welcome back to Vlogtober day seven. I've just realised I left the window open all night. Whoops. Anyway, yeah. Um just getting ready to go to work. I'm meeting my dad for pancakes first. Because I can tell you all now because by the time you see this everyone important that I need to tell first would know, but I got the job. I got the job. So yeah, I have a new job working at the cinema which I'm really looking forward to so yep you gotta go do it that's a dad taking me for pancakes to celebrate which I'm really looking forward to and then I'm off to work and that's why oh what is that that is gross yeah I'm off to work till seven and then we'll be home and probably watch soaps and eat dinner but I'll try and do something interesting in between Hi guys, it is considerably later in the evening, it's about 8 o'clock, I know there's not much before this. We went for pancakes and I forgot to vlog because we were celebrating me getting my new job. But I didn't want to say to you, now I look all greasy and horrible because I was... I was going to say to you, what did you think of my skin as I've only got BB cream on today? But looking at it now, I've just climbed all my flights of stairs and walked from the bus stop. I look all greasy and red and horrible, so I'm trying to see if I can get it better. And set the light off me a bit. See, it, it's just like a light covering foundation. It's quite, um, I quite liked it. It's not as good now, obviously, because I've had it on for about seven hours, but, and I've just walked up four flights of stairs. But it looked really good this morning. I'll try and show you tomorrow morning just how good it actually looked. I'm going to chill, have some dinner. I heard on Radio 1 earlier while I was at work, that um, something Sherlock related is being played after the Bake Off, so I'm planning to get that on to see what that little sneak preview is and have some dinner, so I will talk to you in a bit. Right, dinner is leftovers from yesterday, uh, the chilli, the cheese, a couple of wraps and a sugar-free Rabina. I need to get back on the Slimmer World bandwagon as of tomorrow, so get rid of all this stuff catching up on a bit of holly oaks i needed to use up that butternut squash i brought the other day for that recipe because i never actually used it however i did not contemplate what a disaster it would be to cut and now i have to tidy that all up i literally just wanted to roast it with a bit of chicken and some feta cheese for tomorrow for my lunch and yeah, now I'm instantly regretting it because I have to tidy this up. It's not fair. Right, we are literally minutes away from finding out what this sneak peek thing from Sherlock is. Literally, the bake-off is ending as we speak. So, fingers crossed it's something good. I bet it's something really crappy and like, literally just like a mini trade or something. But yeah, I'm going to sit down and find out. And then they're going to put my... But let's squash in the Avon. We couldn't resist a trip down Baker Street tonight. A preview from you know who coming by town. I think that was it. So we're getting a preview, which is going to be really exciting. Whoop, 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 whoop. I bet it's actually really crap, and we're getting excited over nothing. Century. 
Now that was pretty cool. I actually enjoyed that. I love them too as um, Sherlock characters. I think it's quite, it's, it's a really good drama and it's really, really funny. But I never really liked Benedict Cumberbatch before I saw him as Sherlock. I caught him, I actually watched it all one day on um, Netflix, both series, and I thought it was really good. So I'm looking forward to that. That's literally just made my night. That's the most exciting part of the vlog, probably. Now let's go back to the bird and nut squash because I need to put it in. Now, Slimming World means I have to use Frylight, which I haven't used in ages, so I don't know where it is. Oops. Oh, it's over there. It's over there. Um. Give that a shake up. Oh. Oh, it's all, it's all, it's all going wrong. Oh, I dropped it. Oh, whoa. Right, yeah. I'm going to put you down while I just get some chicken to put on one. Right, that's it. And I need to get to tidying up my mess now so that I can have a bath, go to bed. We've got the new Once Upon a Time tonight, which I want to watch literally as soon as Kieran gets in. So... I need to find out if he wants to know because I haven't cooked him anything yet. And then, yeah, that's pretty much it. Anyone watch Dr. Foster and think it's any good? Because I've heard really good things, but I'm running a little bit behind. I don't even know if it's bother catching up now. So, yeah, let me know. Right, I have just got out of the bath. I haven't taken my makeup off yet because I couldn't be bothered. I forgot to take my um, cleansing water in the bath and stuff, so... I'll do that in a bit. Yeah, again, Kieran didn't make the bed, as per usual. Oh, he gets on my nerves. Literally, just as I've said that, his text has popped up as well, saying he's on his way home. But, yeah, literally, I am getting super excited because he's on his way home. And we are going to watch... There's a bloody moth and it won't leave me alone. It's getting on my nerves. Stitch, stitch. That is my stitch top that we got from Disney years ago, and now I use it as a nighty because I'm not that fat anymore. Got an itchy foot. I think there's the bug on it. I think there's a moth on my foot. Right, where was I? Yeah, I was telling you that we are going to watch this bad boy. What a face to leave the TV on to see if we can get it. No, it's too washed out. Let me see if I'll touch the camera around. That is not a good face to land on. Like, it looks like one of them faces that you know when you accidentally pause your video and you get caught in a really dodgy face. But yeah, I'm getting this set up so that when Kieran comes in, we can watch it straight away. Look how good she looks. I don't know where I was not recording from, but basically, yeah. So I've got to get my dinner out of the oven. Not dinner, lunch for tomorrow, sorry. Out of the oven. Then we're chilling and watching Netflix. So I'm going to end this vlog here. I've got one more full day at work and then we are off for the weekend. We've got two days in Yarmouth, so they'll be fun of vlogs. But yeah, I'm going to leave this one here. I'll speak to you tomorrow. Bye.